What's up, everybody? I haven't done a video. Actually, I haven't done any deep space astrophotography in a month. We've had nothing but bad weather. Rain, snow, rain, snow, clouds, everything like that for a whole month. So tonight, it's going to be clear for the next two nights, and it's just about no moon out. So I had to, since no moon, I had to go broadband. So I chose a target that I've never done before. This is uh, M109. It's a galaxy right by the Big Dipper. Never tried this one before, but I said, let me try it. I'm not sure if it's going to work out with this refractor. Let me just uh, do a, a stretch high right here. You can barely see the galaxy right here. It's small, too, but I, I'm, I haven't seen a lot of pictures of it. I said, let me just try it out, but um, you can barely see it right here. It's so faint. But this is my luminance frame, so uh, maybe that's why. But it's I'm only doing one-minute exposure for luminance. But that's the galaxy right there. So I'm not sure how it's going to look, how it's going to turn out. Um... I got about close to nine, a little bit over nine hours remaining tonight because uh, one good thing is that this constellation is in view the entire night tonight. So I have, do have a meridian flip around uh, one o'clock in the morning. So hopefully that goes successful because I will be asleep at that time. Hopefully the meridian flip is successful and everything centers back in correctly. But I'm doing 90 uh, frames for luminance at one minute. And my red, green, and blue filters, I'm doing two minutes each. And I'm doing 75 minute, I mean 75 photos at two minutes each. So I hope that's going to come out successfully. Um, let's see what guiding looks like. Guiding 1.14. I didn't calibrate anything. I just let it go. Just start up, start up and let it run. Look how dim this star is right here. That the Loeb Star X2 camera is picking up. You know, that's some dim stars. That, that camera is so sensitive it can just pick up some of the dimmest stars and guide one. That's one good thing. But that Lope Star X2 is a very sensitive camera. So either way, um, hopefully this comes out pretty good. Other than that, stay tuned. It's going down real cold tonight here in uh, Virginia. It's getting down to um, 18 degrees Fahrenheit tonight. So that's pretty pretty cold. I mean, even though I've had this AVX and everything down to minus 3 degrees Fahrenheit, it's been doing good. But it's pretty cold tonight. So my laptop's outside inside the Rubbermaid case, the Rubbermaid tote, and I have a small heating pad under it just to keep it a little bit warmer so that you know, the motherboard doesn't get too cold. Well, that's it for now. Hopefully everything comes out good.